All right, everybody. Here's the infamous Curly. Let's see how close I can get to him. Hello, Curly. Look at that hair. Look at that hair. Curly. It's okay, Curly. And all these ladies. Okay, Curly. Before we make the cheese, you gotta feed the calves. And there's some more here. Come on, ladies. Come on. Wait. There's the rooster of the barn trying to steal some some grain. See who's in charge. Who we'll threw the cow? Looks like the cows win. Sorry, rooster. Cheese house. Hi, <laughs> Eddie. No, <laughs> those are little Amish girls going to school. Schoolhouse Road is actually turns into Quarry Road. This is Quarry Road, and those little Amish girls going to school. One of the cutest things I've seen so far. Mix and cheese. Just put some cultures in there. We're making our Vardy today. We let the culture sit for about six minutes. You just let them sit on top of the batch of milk. And you let them activate. And I guess get some oxygen. The milk. I think uh, it was 88 degrees. Actually, maybe a little cooler. But now we're just mixing cheese. The uh, I'm sorry, milk. Making cheese. All right, I need two hands. Okay, so here we are now. The cheese is, I'm sorry, I keep saying cheese, I guess. I don't know when it's officially cheese, but um, that's sitting. I'm going to mix it in a little bit. But as I wait, I'm making molds. This is cheese cloth in there. All stainless, sanitary, sanitized trays. The um, milk is going to get put into these with your cultures. It's gonna put it in that press right there and all the whey is gonna get squeezed way out. <laughs> so that's cheese making. And I'll show you a couple of other steps right now. Okay, so real quick, cows are here, they get milked. Milk goes in those pipes, goes through there. This is a vacuum, closes vacuum, sucks it in. Comes through here, gets pumped into here. This is a I don't know how many gallons um, cooling tank. That's where they store the milk when it's fresh. They cool it down. It's a big cooling unit inside. Um, these are actually what I plan on using as water storage for my water system. They're stainless steel, this thick, they're hollow inside, it's insulated, um, and there's cooling tubes. So when those cooling tubes go bad, you can't, you know, you're never gonna find where a cooling tube is leaking in there. Um, so they just, you know, they can't use them anymore, they can't fix them. So I'm going to try to buy a couple and use them as storage, my water storage. 
But anyway, right now, part of the cheese making is I'm cleaning it. That is clean soap. This is dirty. Um, they have to do this every time the milk comes and goes out of here. Obviously, you don't want dirty old milk in anything. So we got to clean it out really, really well. It's a lot of work, but it's got to be done. So that's kind of uh, where the milk goes. So the milk comes from up there, out there, one of these pipes, I think up there, maybe. I don't know where it goes, but it goes into there, into there. And then from there, it goes into the cheese room. And that's where we're making cheese. That's where the big bucket is. So put that in your pipe and smoke it. Hey Murphy, you like the milk? He likes raw, organic, freshly squeezed milk from these ladies. What's up ladies? We're making cheese today. You're going to probably want to get out of here, right? Oh look, they all want to go back to the pasture. You guys had your breakfast? Yeah. Oh, hello. Oh, that one burped. Alright ladies, I'm going to wait for Brian to get back to let you go out. But you will get out soon. So here is the rooster of the house. Getting ready to uh, march the ladies out. There's Curly. Let's see if we can go say hi to Curly. We all know who Curly is. Curly could probably just plow this fence over and stampede me, so I will not get too close to him. What's up, ladies? We're making your milk into cheese today. Except for you, Curly. Your milk does not uh, work. You don't make milk, Curly. Sorry. Rooster there, Eddie's waiting, everyone's waiting. Everybody wants to go outside, just like kids should be going outside. The ladies don't like to be outside, inside. They don't like being in a barn all day. They like to be out in those pastures. That's it. Okay, so I just took nine milliliters of, uh, I believe, how long is it? 88 degrees. Um, I stirred it. Took out nine milliliters. Put it in a little test tube. Uh, you want to get that reading down to zero. It's about zero, yeah, it is. <laughs> <laughs> and then uh, I got to put three drops of indicator solution, or other people would call it phenolithiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaiaia
Move it or lose it. Come on. Curly, get him in there. Oh, he's got some friends. Who is he barking at, Eddie? Eddie, watch it go. Where's it go? Eddie, Eddie. He's more interested in his butt. Come on. Come on, get in there. Get on in there. I'm done. Here I am. This is what I look like when I'm stirring the cheese and cutting things up. Okay, so now the curds are in the forms that I made earlier and it's sitting in the way and we're going to sit there for five minutes and then take them from there. And move them to there and squeeze them. Squeeze out all the way. And then you have a big box of cheese. That's it.